I... <laughs> that is a long trailer. Uh, usually they're not that long. Um, but anyway, everyone, my name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am playing some Silent Hill for the room. Now I'm just... Oh, I can put it in Japanese! No, <laughs> I actually do know Japanese, but no, I'm not going to be that mean. Um, I'm actually going to turn the noise effect off because while I was testing, it, it just didn't work very well. It's like something about being on an emulator, so it's up everything. But the actual fo like the image for the static filter is really low res, so it just looks terrible. So we're not going to use the classic filter for this. But yes, I'm playing it on the PlayStation 2 using a widescreen patch. This is the PlayStation 2 version. I don't have the PC version. I know I could have gotten it off of GOG for $10, but I'm going to use the copy I have. <laughs> It was two years ago that Henry Townsend moves into the room 302 of the a South Ashfield Heights, an apartment building in the medium-sized city of Ashfield. Henry was happy and enjoying his new life. I, but five days ago, something strange happened. He began to have a recurring dream each night. One other thing. Just a little thing. He couldn't leave room 302. It's just, just, just a little thing. Just a little thing. Just a little smidgen. I'm sure, it's fine. Looks fine. Looks gross. Looks, uh... Hell world, dear. <laughs> this is gonna go well. I've never actually played this game. I have seen um, a large portion of it, so I guess I would call this Let's Play Semi Blind. <laughs> Excuse me, bruh. What's with this room? You're in the hell world, bruh. Uh, let me out. Okay. <laughs> I can't get close to the door. Hello? It's covered in blood and rust. I... This is my room. What the hell's happened to it? I don't know. I didn't do it. Oh my god, this is slippery. Okay. This control scheme is really slippery. So this is really my room? Probably. Potentially. I'm sure it's fine. It's a face! Creepy, it looks like a face. You look like a face. <laughs> Your mom looks like a face. Oh, this is fine. This is fine. Oh, this is fine. <laughs> you know, just barrel roll out the window, Henry. I mean, sure you can't go out your door, but you can probably break some glass. I would think. Or just don't. This is some ring Sadako inspired shit. Sadako being the Japanese name of Samara from The Ring, if you guys have only seen these shitty American ones. Hi. It's like Kayako and Sadako had a son. <laughs> I actually do have the Wii um, grudge game, by the way. Probably won't let's play it, at least not for a long time. It's just like an on-rails haunted house thing. It's timed. I did watch my ex-girlfriend play through it though. It was hilarious. <laughs> also, like one of the most expensive Wii games. I I know this is Silent Hill, but now I'm just on a tangent. Yeah, the Juwon the Grudge game for the Wii is expensive. That thing goes for like 60, 70 bucks. It's one of the most expensive Wii games I've ever seen. I'm like, bruh. No. <laughs> Granted, it's, it wouldn't be that hard to be an expensive, to be one of the very few expensive Wii games, seeing as so much of the Wii is shovelware. I do have the Silent Hill Shattered Memories for the Wii, though. I don't have the PS2 version. I only have the Wii version. But eventually I want to get all of the ports because I am a collector and I have a problem. <laughs> 
Or is it a problem? I don't think it's a problem. Other people might think it's a problem. That is blurry and I don't like it. I don't like looking at it. I'm not gonna look at it. Okay, it's fine now. I don't like it when the games do that like double vision thing. Oh man. This gives me a headache. You all right, bro? You need to go you need to go what shave. A dream. You need to go shave, bro. Got some uh got some patchy stubble there. Yeah, okay, bro. Oh, right. Can't use directional pad. Uh okay. Why even let me move forward like the two things? Just go straight into using the super low res phone. Super low res. I mean, I know this game's not gonna look as good as one, two, and three. Especially three. But so if I recall, this was made by Silent Hills, uh, Team Silent's B team. It wasn't made by the core of Team Silent, and it was the last. I believe it was the last game that was developed by the team proper before it got shelved out to um, shitty overseas Western developers that have made nothing but mediocre games Hello? since then. Don't at me. Help me. What? Huh? The cord's cut. <gasps> You need some emotion there for your voice, Henry? <laughs> You're looking a little derp. Not gonna lie. It's like... Oh, okay, I see. So you can go up and down with... and Yeah, you can use the right analog stick as a proper camera. Or you can just use the left analog stick as tank controls. Okay. That that does make it a little bit easier to control if I just think of that. Five days ago, that's when I first had the nightmare. Oh, are we doing that double vision shit again? I haven't been able to get out of my room since then. The phone doesn't work, the TV doesn't work, I can't even get anybody to hear me when I yell. My whole world has suddenly turned in insane. My door is chained up and the windows are sealed shut. But the windows are made of glass! Break them! On top of that, someone chained the door from the inside. How am I gonna get out of here? Break the window! <laughs> Don't go out, Walter, okay? What the hell? Is that all you have to say to that, bro? What's going on here? Again, break your window. Break your window and climb out, bruh. It's Eileen Galvin from next door. Oh, man. Hi. Hope my luck changes before the party. About that. <laughs> May not have played this game before, but man, do I know what can happen to her. Ah, <laughs> uh, is that it? Cool. Uh, what's in the fridge? Chocolate milk! Cool. I didn't do it. Oh, it closed itself. Okay. There's obviously something behind this. What I mean when I was a kid, when I graduated from high school, why would you have that on your... I don't know, it just seems weird to me to have that. There's obvious... No, I don't want to look outside. There's an obvious paper there. Uh-oh. It's a person. It's a very low-poly person. Waiting for something. Who's very tired. And somebody's running somewhere. Yeah, okay, bye-bye. I mean, I know who that is, but... Looks like a scrap from some book. Man, this thing looks like it was written ages ago. Through the ritual of the Holy Assumption, he built a world. It exists in a place, in a space separate from the world of our Lord. More accurately, it is within, yet without the Lord's world. Unlike the world of our Lord, it is a world of an extreme flux. Unexpected doors or walls, moving floors, odd creatures, a world only he can control. Anyone swallowed up by that world will live there for eternity, undying. They will haunt that realm as a spirit. 
How can our Lord forgive such an abomination? This part of the book is too damaged to read. It is important to travel lightly in that world. He who carries too heavy a burden will regret it. The book is too damaged to read anymore. It's not a book. It's a piece of paper. <laughs> the book scrap, bruh. This chest could hold a lot of stuff. Cool. Let me put the chocolate milk away. Don't really need it right now. I didn't do it. Wasn't me. I didn't do it. Nope, not me. Didn't do it. Oh, it's a paper. What's that? What was that noise? <laughs> Wrong game. Mom, why don't you wake up? Okay. I. That sounds. Wait, is there something in my shoe? Oh no, that's just the way it's textured. I'm sure this is gonna be fine. Maybe not. <laughs> nice reflection in the mirror there, Henry. What the hell? Is that all you know how to say? S somebody in there? Basil stuck in my teeth. I wonder if I can get this way. <laughs> Broke the window! <laughs> I just peeked my microphone doing that, but whatever. Ah, the old nostalgic sound effects. This looks safe. Again, this is straight up the ring. This is straight up Ringu reference right here. Boy, epilepsy warning. It's fine, though. It's only a little bit of eye twitching that this screen effect causes. <sighs> Not as bad as the damn screen shake in Dead Space. <sighs> oh, it's too bright. <laughs> oh, hi, bunny. One of my rabbits is sleeping in a patch of sunlight on my floor right now. It's super cute. I'd show you guys, but I don't want to move my camera. Actually. Bunny, 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 bunny. You can sort of see him. He's a very sleepy bunny. Now can I get the camera back in place? <laughs> there we go. That's roughly the right spot. <laughs> what the hell? Again, is that the only thing you know how to say, Henry? There are other words in your vocabulary, I hope. I'm just sitting on an escalator, don't worry about it. You know, my mom's scared of escalators. I'm not kidding. Um, when I was growing up, my mother was terrified of escalators. I don't know why. She just was. <laughs> she never really, she could never really articulate or explain why she was scared of them. Who are you? But my mom is scared of escalators. Hi. What's your name? Hi. Henry. And you? <laughs> this is my dream and you don't even know my name. Nope. It's Cynthia. Your dream. That's right. <laughs> this is just a dream. And a really terrible one, too. Yeah, it's not a dream, honey bun. I hope I wake sort up of. soon. So you think this is a dream, huh? Well, if it's not a dream, what is it? Anyway, I want to get out of here, but I can't find the exit. Say, will you help me find it? 
I'm kind of scared all alone. I'll do a special favor for you later. <laughs> uh. It's just a dream, so I might as well have some fun. Again, do you have nothing to say to that, bro? No? I... I have a pipe. <laughs> I don't know how to equip a pipe, but I have one. Toilet! Wait a minute. I'm gonna puke. Well, good thing there's a handy dandy bathroom right there. <laughs> handy dandy bathroom. Handy McDandy dandy. Aww. What a nice guy waiting for her and everything. I'd have left. <laughs> the boys room it's nasty it's nasty <laughs> Get the pipe! I, I, you're just gonna stand there, bro? Bro. Broseph. Broseph. Let's go check on Cynthia. Cynthia! Oh. She gone! Enter the hole! Fire the missiles! Enter the hole! <laughs> Not sure how to equip items. You're just looking the book. Well, so going through the hole gets me back to the apartment. Cool. Because I don't think there's save points in the hell world. What? Another dream. I don't think there is. But it seems so real. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure the only save point is in the apartment. Was I really inside that woman's dream? Oh, that's just stupid. What am I thinking? <laughs> nice voice acting, bro. This seems fine. <laughs> okay, is there anything waiting for me? Wait, did that get moved? Furniture has been here since I moved in. Huh? That's weird. Somebody's moved it. A gun! <laughs> Give it! I need that. There's a pistol on the floor. You don't take the goddamn right I'm taking the pistol. Uh, yeah. It's a goddamn pistol. I didn't do it. I, hi, I, how does Eileen not notice the hole into her apartment? <laughs> also, nice Robbie the Rabbit. That damn broom. Hi. Oh. There it is. Again, how does she not notice? <laughs> Woman! <laughs> how do you not notice? Also, if there is a hole into the other room, you can yell for help now, bro. 
What do you want? Also, why is this only phone in here? Where did you go? Hurry! Save me! If you need a token, there's one here! Okay. How did she call me? Where did you go? I went in the bathroom after you, lady. Uh. This place is haunted. <laughs> Hi, Eileen. Get me out, please. Oh, she's cleaning up the glass. Right. Took her long enough to clean up the glass. Hi, Eileen. Help. It would not take you that long to clean up glass. Okay, bye bye. Okay, bye bye. It's a notepad. How do I save? There's gotta be a save point or something. Oh! <laughs> okay! <laughs> That's gonna be it for this first video because I gotta get ready to live stream. My name is Ms. Scarlet Tanager and I have been playing some Silent Hill for the room. I'll see you all!